Hello everyone. So today I am going to rework on this uh, aim offset that I have implemented. So as you can see here, when I look up, the character turned the rifle up properly to align with the reticle. And when I look down, the character looked down, turned the rifle properly so that uh, it aligns with the reticle always. And I can shoot like this as well so yeah, this is the part I'm gonna do today and here is the uh, demonstration of that aim offset I have developed for this and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons Thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me. Right, and now we have implemented this aim offset for our third person shooter character, exoskeleton character. Uh, then now let's see how to use this aim offset within the animation blueprint. So, right now. This part is from my previous implementation uh, of the aim in of rotating the aim in direction. I was doing it through this transform modify bones. Now I'm going to discard that part because there were there because there were some problems with that. And then I'm going to use this newly created standing aim offset. So we will need another one for the crouching part as well but first let's see how this turns out so let's connect this all right and let's promote ah, we have the email rotation so actually we also uh, before setting this up let's see the way I set the main rotation well it is like this set the main rotation here so I get the main rotation from the character through this interface event uh, here what I do is return the character controller or control rotation of the character and here I get that rotation as an input to this set aiming rotation and here I set the aiming rotation like this so this is the previous part let's put that aside because I'm going to do it new so let's first do a print and see what we get here uh, Here I have disabled this toggle layer for testing purposes. Now I'm going to reconnect it. Okay. It looks horrible, of course. Ah, right, right. The problem is this. Here I This is wrong because let me open the gun blueprint. Where is it? Here I was using the not. No, this is the previous skeletal mesh of the gun. 
uh, I showed you was this Gripple editor which I did in a couple of episodes, two episodes ago as I remember. So here the root is here of the gun compile. Now it's okay. And this is also everything zero. Alright. Uh, right, well, I think uh, instead of this one, what if I Actually, we can do it like this. We should be able to do it like this. Now we don't need this middle layered blending part. This is redundant now. Let's see how it looks. Okay, this is the problem. Uh, we implemented this. This should be used as the base animation for the aim offset. So, right. Let me drag and drop this here. And then use this as the input to this one. And here. How it looks now. Oh, horrible. Hmm. Ah, right. The problem is this this is aim down, aim center. So, as the base pose, I have selected. The wrong idle I mean I should use this one instead okay so how to fix it can I drag can drop the correct one right this is correct and we should do the same the others the confusion I'll name this one idle aiming base 
right. No. The dog. Face. Right. Left. Now everything looks base. Right now everything looks alright. Okay. Mm. Let's see. Okay, it looks fine now. Mm -hmm. Right. We have small problems, but mostly fine. Right now, let's see. Oh, I forgot one more thing. As I look, as I look straight, you can see the pitch is zero and as I look up pitch goes to plus 60 and as I look down pitch goes to 300 so yeah so using that we can set the pitch like this Rotator and set rotation, set timing rotation. Split this so pitch. We have to select pitch like this. If this one is larger than well, 300. we have to get this one uh, if it is false we can directly use it otherwise um, we have to reduce or subtract this amount from 300 no, no, no other way around My, subtract 300 from that amount yeah is it correct oh, sorry 360 of course it should be minus Right now, let's see. Oh, wait, I forgot to use that value here for the pitch. Get timing rotation split and connect pitch like this. Okay, perfect, it works nicely. Uh, we have problem here all right so instead of 300 let's use a value like 100 okay perfect and how to fix this left hand problem Because left hand does not quite fit with the rifle. Well, we have to edit the animation for that. Alright, I modified 
the animation a little bit so that uh, it's minimum but not completely removed well we have to work on that okay so right I'll stop this episode at this point and yeah so in the next episode let's continue to solve the remaining problems and resolve uh, or, or restore shooting game abilities to the character right so the project files will be available through the patreon page and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye